Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Dear students, today, inshallah, we will solve the workbook exercise of chapter seven, sound and hearing. Let's start from the true and false. So, the speed of the sound in air is about three hundred and thirty meters per second. In water, the speed of the sound is much slower. So, it's a false statement. The pitch of sounds means how high or low the sound is. It depends on how rapidly the vibrations are produced. True statement. The size of the vibration affected by the volume of the sounds produced. True statement. Tinnitus is a persistent ringing in the air caused by the exposure to loud sounds for a very long period. True statement. Concert halls and cinemas have sound absorbers on the walls and ceilings so that the audience is not a different. A uh, different by too much noise. It's also a true statement. Now come towards the multiple choice questions. The first statement is: Sounds with a large amplitude have a high pitch, high volume, low pitch, or low volume. So the correct option is option B, high volume. Come towards the second statement: Sounds can be shown as a waves on the screen of the microscope, periscope, telescope, or an oscilloscope. So the correct statement is an oscilloscope. What happens to the vibrations of a guitar strings if it is tightened? So the options are option A, it vibrates with a greater amplitude. Option B, it vibrates with a greater frequency. Option C, it vibrates with a lo lower amplitude. And option D, it vibrates with a lower frequency. So the correct option is option B, it vibrates with a greater frequency. The fourth statement of multiple choice questions are: Airs are energy changers. What do you they turn sound energy into? Electrical energy, heat energy, kinetic energy, or light energy? So the correct answer is electrical energy. Option A. Noise is measured in decibels, decibels, decimals, or disposals. So the correct option is option A. Uh, sorry, option B. Decibels. Look at these pictures of the musical instruments which produces sounds in different waves. So we have these musical instruments. The question is: Sort the instruments into three groups. Each group should contain instruments which are played in the same way. List the three groups under these headings. So in first group, we will put mouth organ, saxophone, flute, and trumpet. All these instruments are used to be there where you can blow into it. The second group is harp, guitar, cello, and tabular bells. So all of them are using strings to produce sounds. And in third group, we will put then a tambourine, drum, and xylophone, where the skin of such uh, such instruments are used to be there for producing sound. The second part of this question is choose one instrument from each group and explain how the sound is produced. So in first group, we will take a trumpet that produces sound when air column vibrates. From the second group, we will take cello, produce sounds when the strings vibrates, and from the third group, we will take the drum where the sound produced when the skin vibrates. The third part of this question is describe one way in which you can change the volume of a drum. So. We can change the sound volume of a drum by tightening its skin. The fourth part is describe two ways in which you can change the pitch of a guitar string. So, the first thing is that by tightening its string, and the second one is by changing the length of the strings. The fifth part of this question is explain why the sounds from a piano is louder and clearer when the when the lid is open. So, the answer is the sounds waves produced by the piano travel. Through the open lid instead of being reflected and absorbed inside a closed piano. Come towards the fourth part, a fourth question of this exercise. The following sentence is not in a correct order. Explain how the sounds from the drone travels to your ears. So, write the letter from each sentence in the correct order, starting with C. So C is the first statement. The drummer strikes the drum with a drumstick. It's A. Now the B will be option E. The drum skin vibrates up and down, and then A is the third statement. The vibrating drum skin makes air molecules vibrate backwards and forwards, and then we will move towards the D. 
The sound spreads out as moving air affects the molecules next to them and B will be the last one.